Hi, I'm Chris. And I'm Robert. And this is a mill. In this video, Chris will show how to zero the digital readout on an edge of a part using an edge finder. Install the edge finder in the spindle. The tip of the edge finder is spring loaded and will be used to locate the edge of the part. Turn the spindle on to 1000 RPM. Lower the spindle and move the edge finder towards the part. The tip of the edge finder will initially oscillate. As the edge finder begins to touch the part, the oscillation will decrease until the edge finder is centered. When the edge finder reaches the edge of the part, it will kick out to the side. Watch it one more time. Move the edge finder very slowly into the part and stop as soon as it kicks out to the side. Look at the edge finder parallel to the direction of motion. It is difficult to see the edge finder kicking out while looking at it perpendicular to the direction of motion. As soon as the edge finder kicks out to the side, zero the digital readout. The tip of the edge finder has a diameter of 200 thousandths. As a result, when the edge finder touches the part, there is a 100 thousandths offset between the center line of the spindle and the edge of the part. As a result, move the table 100 thousandths towards the edge finder, then zero the axis again. Now the machine is zeroed with the center of the spindle directly above the edge of the part.